Archie. <laughs> do you remember me? I sure do, Mr. Champlin. <laughs> this is Walter Perry. He's my promotions manager. Oh, good to meet you. Jim, of course, you know, and that's yeah. Bill Oliver. And, and uh, this, this is for you. Oh, my. And you must be Anna Harriel. You're in Archie's book. You're the heroine. It's an adventure. It's a phenomenal love story, a beautiful love story between a man of early 40s and a girl who's 20. And uh, set in the most romantic and extraordinary circumstances. And uh, it deals with, uh, obviously, the whole question of a sort of Walter Mitty character who, by force of circumstance, takes on another personality and gets caught up with it and can't let it go. And one of the reasons he can't let it go is that the girl um, is very much in love with him. Not only in love with him, but love, in love with everything that he stands for, the traditions and the customs and so on, and what we would then call the Red Indian Nation. Bloody marvelous. Super much better. Oh. I suppose, you know, I started as an actor and I wanted to be a movie star, and now I'm a movie star, I want to be an actor. So, <laughs> I'm just having a ball. Brown. Brown. If you combine the performance plus the magic of the personality, and you believe him as a native Indian, you really do. So I can't think, in fact, I asked him three times to play the picture, and three times it was not possible until the last time. So I wouldn't have cast anybody else. This is really something. I can't believe I'm here. I mean, it's as if I walked into the pages of your book. We sent out 50 advanced copies. The reactions are terrific, right off the map. Most of all in England. No one's ever read a book by a real Red Indian before. I mean, it just amazes people. It's like, it's 